This video will demonstrate how to measure your conveyor's squareness, otherwise referred to as shaft alignment. The term squareness refers to the alignment of the drive and tail shafts of a conveyor. Many chain issues can arise from a misalignment of the shafts. The wider mat top chains are assembled, the more critical to the performance of the chain the shaft alignment will become. Shaft alignment is most critical for wide tunnel applications, such as pasteurizers, warmers, or coolers. These chains usually span over 10 feet in width. There are many instances when you will want to measure your conveyor squareness. If you are working on a chain that is currently installed in your application, always follow your lockout tagout procedures before approaching the chain. To measure your conveyor squareness, you will need a tape measure and a level. To measure shaft alignment, four distances need to be measured. First, ensure that both shafts are horizontal. This can be done with a level. Next, begin to measure the four distances. Measure the distances of point A to point B and C to D. Then measure from point B to point C and point A to point D. To ensure that your shafts are parallel, the measurements you take from point A to point B should equal those from C to D. Also, points B to C should equal A to D. If all of these are true, then your shafts are parallel. Finally, double check that the middle drive and idler sprockets are locked down in the same position on each parallel shaft. Adjust shafts and sprockets accordingly until alignment is complete. Ensuring conveyor squareness in your application can remedy some common issues, such as chain tracking issues, pins walking out of the chain, and premature wear or failure of your chain. For more information or documentation, please visit rexnord.com or contact Flattop Application Engineering.